Well, here we are. A beautiful uh, Saturday morning. It's going to rain later. And you know what happens when it rains. Oh, I'm drinking this uh, South African product. Limited edition. The Rugani people. 100% cloudy apple juice. It really is good. Very sweet. Right there. Pour some more into my cup here. It's a cup I pour here. I said, cup of state, but it's a cup state here. I'm at my friend's house, Somerset West, and put some more in there. And I had a little uh, lime that I used as deodorant, throw it in there. Why? <laughs> my sister is my sister. Anyway, um, so I would look. Uh, look. <laughs> I've been I've been neglecting my YouTube channel in terms of um, the waxing, you know. Now, this is supposed to be my the channel was originally started for me to be like a, like memoir, you know, stuff that happened and in, in my life. And I, anyway, I've neglected that because I've done a lot of some good interviews. Ooh, I'm on an interview frenzy here about uh, my last few dates here in Cape Town as I go to the states. Um, so anyway, leave all that. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna rain later on. That means I'm gonna go to the I'm gonna go to the lobby and theater. You know these big theaters like the Sturt Kennecourt and, the, and these theaters like that. You have to actually have a card or something. Like you get a book on whatever that they don't allow you. To, you can't take no cash. But the lobby and theater is an old timey theater. <laughs> they take the money. They get the, the, the little uh, a real ticket goofy thing. You know, lady behind it. You know, she's nice to them. I use my senior citizen status. Anyway. Uh, see what you know. They, they show popular movies, but I like to see the, the independent movies. So there's a, there's a couple there, and hopefully I'll get to see it today. Um, but now I gotta go to Parallel Valley. I gotta meet up. I'm perhaps do an interview. Who knows? Um, but let me tell you what, what's been happening in terms of it's been very interesting. I, I took a walk. If you go to my Instagram, you see some pictures on on this walk from Mulberry uh, through Mulberry through Observatory through. Um, Salt River, Woodstock, then was where I, and then I went to Woodstock where I used to live, the house I was in there, took that picture, stuff by um, Mr. Parker's, well he passed it. Anyway, Mr. Parker's, I have to get back there because um, uh, uh, Serena, I got to see her anyway. It's one of the people I worked in the store. And then I walked uh, on Roberts Road where I used to live and took a picture of that. I haven't put that up on it. Maybe I should put that up on it. Then, then what I did, I said, well, let me keep on, uh, I said this anyway, I'm going to go to town, right? Tell me the, the central CBD, they call it, whatever, the, the center of Cape Town. Actually, the center of Cape Town, to tell you the truth, is actually, uh, it's actually like longer as far as, as, far as geographically. Weird. But, but you know, the, the central business district is what they, what they, they wax on about. Anyway, then I walked, because well, that, that house on Roberts Road, when I was there, you know, I had my little office in the house, right? But I also had an office at UCT, where I was teaching, right? And I had an office in town at Adassa, right? <laughs> Six Penn Street, right? So, so I could, and they both was like, almost like equal distance. So I would walk either, either way, you know, like that. Anyway, so when I was walking to town, I wouldn't just walk the main road and whatever. I would walk up uh, uh, through, basically, uh, from Woodstock, this place called, like, like the area called uh, uh, Zona Bloom. It's up, where the mosque is. Anyway, I walk up there, up there, Cape Peninsula College, like that. I walk up there and then walk down, and just remembering my old walks, right? And I got to town and uh, did stuff. <laughs> had a great, had, had an interview, had an interview. Uh, it's up on, look, if you're on this YouTube channel, you really shouldn't be hearing me wax and wane. This is just for historical purposes or archival purposes only, right? You need to go to the interview playlist. Oh, ooh, wee. As Jackie would say, got some really good interviews. Mm, mm, mm. I've been interviewing for a long time. I've been interviewing since what, long, that's, oh, that's right. This is like, I'm 50 years in radio, 2002. 50 years in radio. I guess officially be the end of the year. 50 years in radio. I started radio in 1972. Go figure. <laughs> and, and I've been interviewing since the mid-70s, right? So basically, like, see, when I interview, I don't uh, edit. Even these, I don't edit, right? 
And I think what's ha what happens, I've been, I interview some, you know, all, all kinds of people that I have these chops. So my, 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 well, my, my conversations, my chats, you know, you have, you have the people now the podcast and all of a sudden they get a, and they have these conversations, deep conversations, blah, 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 blah. and you know, but I've been doing that for years. Even, even when I started in radio in, in, in 1972 with, with um, Saturday Soul with JB, with JB's traveling. Hey, JB, shout out. I think he's in Switzerland going to Greece. Uh, or see the, whatever. Anyway, um, and we did a program. That program we did, you know, we pioneered. I, we got to get that online, man, because he's got the tapes. I saw the poet in residence. Oh, I sounded really young. Going like, I don't know, some of these poems. But he, he seems to be the poem is good, so we'll see what happens. I think he's trying to publish it. If you hear motorcycle, this is, uh, uh, what do you call it, Somerset West. These people are, mm, the big noise. They have to put, <laughs> do attention seeking, well. Anyway, so all I'm trying to do is keep you up to date, because I haven't done what I'm supposed to do. So now I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. But I'm going to have some more interviews to do. I want to do a lot of interviews before I leave. Uh, get some South African thing. I'm going to miss God's uh, thing today, I think, but I'll, I'll see what happens. So that's it. I just want to, you know, keep you abreast of what's going on, just so you know, right? But things are, um, oh, things, okay, now I'm, I'm going to go off, because there's, there's some stuff that, it's very funny, like uh, not the apple juice, but, um, okay, look, go to my Instagram, right? Um, at Anthony J. Dot Sloan. Uh, Anthony J. Dot Sloan. And, uh, and all the stuff that I'm going through, the, the pictures I take, you know, on my walks, whatever happened, you see that little interviews. I saw a nail the other day, he's going to be in New York. Uh, uh, Oswald, a bunch of people that I, that I know. And so you can be entertained. Because <laughs> I, I make them short, I don't be waxing and waning and doing like that. So anyway, oh, I just talked to my sister this morning. She's, well, I just talked to my sister this morning. What can I say? <laughs> All the stuff in, in, in Dubai is going swimmingly well. Uh, Everything is going well, right? I'll keep you. Did I say it already? I'll say it again. I, T, from the Patterson's taking the train to bed, will let you know what I only suspect in the coming hours and months and days and all that stuff. 